Hi, I'm Doug Reichert Powell, and I'm here to ask you to support the Pike County, Kentucky Public Library System. I was born and raised in the Appalachian Mountains, and I've been studying and writing about the region for many years, so I was sad and angry to learn that on April 28th and 29th, a Nazi group called the Traditional Workers' Party is planning a conference and rally in Pikeville, Kentucky, in the heart of coal country. These Nazis believe that they can cash in on the misfortune that has been visited upon the Appalachians by history of exploitation to recruit a few misguided people into their toxic worldview. Fortunately, the people of eastern Kentucky, along with their friends and neighbors, are rising to meet this latest attempt to exploit the region. The same weekend as the traditional Workers' Party get together, Pikeville will host a rally for equality and American values, downtown Pikeville, April 29th, that will make clear to these Nazis that the people of Appalachia, like all patriotic Americans, are not buying the poison that they are peddling. Whether or not you can join Pikeville's patriotic celebration, I hope you will join me in a simple act that will benefit the people of Pike County, Kentucky, and in a small but significant way, directly counter these Nazi thugs. I'm writing a check to the Pike County Public Libraries and putting it straight in the mail to the attention of Ms. Charlene Hopkins, Pike County Public Library District, 119 College Street, Pikeville, Kentucky, 41502. As the social safety net has withdrawn in recent times, libraries have increasingly stepped into the gap providing not just books and internet access, but common spaces and unique learning experiences for children and adults, men and women, rich and poor, just like a democracy ought to. And yet, like so many of our democratic institutions, public libraries and the Pike County libraries in particular face the challenge that, as their mission has expanded, their financial support has receded. Last year, Pike County Libraries faced a $5.1 million deficit as tax revenue from coal mining dried up. This shortfall resulted in layoffs for 19 employees. And the next thing you know, here come the Nazis. I don't think that's a coincidence. Folks in the Appalachian Mountains are justifiably sick of people from all points on the political spectrum coming in and trying to tell them what's best. But here's a chance to do something that pretty much everybody who isn't a Nazi agrees is a good thing. The way I see it, supporting libraries is one of the best ways to oppose Nazis for the long haul, using knowledge to fight ignorance. It's not about right versus left. It's about right versus wrong. Please join me in supporting Pike County Libraries, supporting Appalachia, and supporting American democracy. You can send your donation to Pike County Public Library District. Attention, Ms. Charlene Hopkins, 119 College Street, Pikeville, Kentucky, 41502. I thank you very much.